still waiting on the roof from France, which hasn't arrived yet. Hopefully later this month sometime. But what has been done is this area, which has been exposed to the elements and weeds for 30 odd years, has been dug over twice. And now we're putting a layer of fresh horse manure on it. And then uh, we're gonna put some topsoil on that. And then we're gonna roll out this plastic and put it over. And that way we will cook the weeds. The weeds will all die and anything else that hasn't been dug out. And um, underneath the uh, weed suppressor. And then next year we'll be able to grow stuff directly in the soil in here because we'll have hopefully killed most of the weeds. So once the, we've put the topsoil on and we put this down, I'll then be able to use the cold frame or hot box, whatever you want to call it, up against the wall there and start bringing my seedlings in to here while we're waiting for the roof to arrive. So we're kind of, we're still working away. Oh, look at you, still wanting to eat the horse shit. You guys, you're so bold. Oh, and these are my, that's my shelving unit with my free timber that um, we painted. These are the shelves that will go in this apparatus that is going to go there. So it's all slowly but surely getting there. But it's lovely having this lovely stone wall on two sides of the greenhouse or vine house. Here's the vine. And let's see. It's being held in place by old metal braces like this one. That was there before. I didn't put that one in. So um, hopefully it will be uh, blooming soon. Looking, oh, there's a bit of cement that's fallen. There, yes, there's some leaves. That's some leaves from the, uh, of the grapevine. So it's beginning to leaf. Let's see further over here on this wall. Yep, there's a leaf right there. So you can see it's uh, the vine of the vine house is still alive and well. And it's gonna go all the way up there it was a big pruning job to get it going to begin with. This vine that is in the vine house, I'm told, might not survive because it'll be too hot with the roots inside, but it's still alive, you can see there. Anyway, that's progress so far. No door for the door yet. One day that'll occur. Hey, stop eating your vegetables. You're pre-cooked horse shit vegetables. I know all of you. Look at you chowing down on your pre-cooked vegetables. Okay, next topsoil and then that black stuff.